We arrested 51-year-old Mohammed Saeed and charged him for the murder of two Muslim men in our community, Aftab Hussein and Mohammed Faisal Hussein. Uh, we are working with the District Attorney's Office on potential charges for the murder of two other Muslim men, Niam Hussein and Mohammed Zaire Ahmadi. We started to focus in on Mr. Saeed uh, and last night secured a search warrant for his residence near Gibson and Carlisle in southeast Albuquerque. As we were getting ready to execute that search warrant, we saw him load into a vehicle. As a matter of fact, the vehicle we believed that was used in the homicides that we put out on the poster, and we followed him. Uh, with the help of state police, we were able to stop that car near Santa Rosa, New Mexico, and at the same time, our SWAT team executed a search warrant safely on the occupied home, taking all the residents out and allowing our crime scene and homicide investigators to go into that home. These losses are felt deeply in our community, and especially for me, as one of these individuals slain last week, Mohammed Afzal Hussein, my dear friend and former staffer, whose family is with us here today. Muhammad was kind, hopeful, optimistic, a city planner who believed in democracy and in social change, and who believed that we could, in fact, build a brighter future for our communities and for our world. Now, I also want to express gratitude to the Muslim community. I know uh, all of us are doing that, but it's for a very, very good reason. They never gave up on our police department, and they never gave up on the city where they live. And I want to thank you for doing that. There is no way we could have put these pieces together without them.